Una new entry del nostro campionato ma che era nel mirino dell'Aquila Basket Trento già da un po' di tempo. Terzo miglior marcatore in Bundesliga nell'annata 2021-2022, l'anno scorso ha militato nella squadra satellite dei Boston Celtics. Di chi sto parlando? Del protagonista di oggi della puntata di Nice to Meet. Io sono Alessandra Trupiano e lui è Kamar Baldwin. So today I'm in Trento with Kamar Baldwin. First of all, nice to meet you, man. Nice to meet you as well. How are you doing? Doing good. How about you? I'm pretty much good. Yes. Okay. With you, I want to start to talk about the fact that this is your first time in Italy. So I want to know your first impact with the country, but also with the league, with the team. Uh, about the country, uh, it's beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, being in the mountains uh, is my first time, like, I guess, living in the mountains. So uh, it's the first time I've experienced, but uh, I'm enjoying it. Um, you know, just really enjoying Trento and then about um, the league, uh, my teammates and just getting to know them a lot and uh, we're just really getting to know each other on and off the court. So uh, it's been a great experience so far. Okay, perfect. I know Trento put the eyes on you since a lot of time. You had different options. Why choosing this team? Yeah, I felt like uh, Trento, they really wanted me. Mm -hmm. um, and also, you know, they played Euro Cup and I uh, heard Italy is a very competitive league. So um, I felt like I could come here and uh, be successful and also help Trento um, reach the goals that they want to reach as well. First year in Italy, what did you expect from this year? And about maybe you have some goals, some personal goals you have to reach during this, this year? Uh, for me, it's mostly, uh, you know, about the team, you know, just making sure that uh, we're playing good basketball, making sure we're winning, you know, hopefully win every single game that we play. <laughs> Um, you know, and just being competitive and, uh, you know, hopefully winning championships, whether it's Euro Cup uh, or in the Italian League, hopefully, you know, both. Okay, I know you played in Germany about two years ago, correct? Uh, in what do you think the Italian Championship is different from the German one in your experience, maybe? Uh, well, I'm not sure because this has been my first year playing in the Italian League, but uh, Germany, it, it was a great league. Uh, it was very competitive. Um, I enjoyed Germany. I loved it a lot. So uh, uh, I guess after this season, you know, I'll be able to compare okay, the gonna, two. We are going to check maybe together. Okay. <laughs> then we jump outside the court because you have any hobbies? You play drums sometimes? Yeah, I play drums. Uh, so growing up, I played for my church. Uh, I play sometimes when I go back also. But uh, other hobbies is uh, watching movies mm -hmm. uh, and just spend a lot of time with my family and my daughter. Yeah, because you're very close to your family. They live here with you. Mm -hmm. Yes, they do. So they came with me to, to Trento. Pretty nice. And uh, if you have to imagine yourself in a, I don't know, five years, you will still play basketball, you maybe have some dreams to, to, to reach? Uh, I hope so. Mm -hmm. um, I hope I can, you know, I want to play as long as I can, mm -hmm. but, uh, you know, fatherhood uh, comes first, so uh, I put my family first, so whatever, you know, whatever happens, that happens. But uh, if I can play, you know, five years from now, I'll, I'll gladly do it. Definitely. We see, but we see also on the court yeah. when this is start. Yeah. yeah. 